Hey everyone, this is Nitro. In this video, I am going to be doing the third battlefield of the Forbidden Battleground. And let me preface this by saying it is an absolute nightmare. For this particular video, I am going to be doing it with the Legion of Glory characters because, uh, well, I did beat it just now. So I wanted to demonstrate a more efficient method of doing so. So let's just jump in and get started. So the party I'm going to bring for my clear is there's going to be Yulia with Godly Menace, Discipline, and Holy Justice. I have Liana here who has Act Again. Um, for this particular fight, I'm going to bring Prayer and Gospel. Okay. Gospel can is very optional, I feel. You know what? Let's just replace the Gospel with, I don't know, Summon Sky Archer. Can draw one of the attacks from these two in particular. Ledin is here to really provide guard, and that's why he has both Divine Guard and Burning Sun, because this catapult can actually remove guard. It's annoying. Elwyn is here to faction buff primarily. So he has faction buff, swords, frontal assault, and his faction buff. And Narm has roundabout, deadeye, and snipe for me. So without any further ado, I think I'm basically ready to begin. And let's just get started then. Here we go. So let's turn the danger zone to start. And the very first thing is I need to faction buff with Elwyn so that everyone else can attack. Right? This Mist Dancer has Flash Dance as well as Cold Blood. So we can move three, move two more, then hit you with a skill that swaps your positions. So why don't I actually just place. So I really have a choice between Ledin or Elwyn to tank that hit. And I think I'm gonna want Ledin to tank it if possible. So I'm simply going to have Elwyn fashion buff right over here. So Elwyn is buffed now. And then I'm going to follow that up with Yulia launching a discipline attack on the succubus to wipe it out instantly. Holy character against demon, instant killing. So I'm going to act again my Yulia now. Because Yulia being intelligence based, magic attacks can ignore the guard skill of this Lancer. So that means, in other words, I can move up and attack. So let's have Yulia charge forward and Godly Menace strike the Shika Mage. And it actually left this guy at 241 hit points. Maybe I should have brought Faith? I don't know. Regardless, that's okay. I am going to have my Ledin toss out a Burning Sun attack on the Sheikah Mage then. Make sure it dies. And since I have access to Narm, why don't I have Narm toss out a Deadeye attack on this Lancer General to lock it down for a turn. Right? And then roundabout back. So there we go. So let in, gets struck by the catapult, then hits by the mist dancer and teleported. And then the gargoyle chooses to go after Liana, right? With the shrine maidens keeping her alive. So things work out for me. She actually looks good. In other words. So everyone, all my enemies are kind of grouped up right now. And what I really wanted to do is take down that catapult. So I think that's the target I'm gonna go after right now. The darn catapult. To remove the debuff, the buff removal. So, melee discipline attack from Yulia. We'll get rid of it. All right. Next is Ledin, who needs the Divine Guard, I think. And Narm to shoot down. You know what? Let's have Narm use Snipe to shoot down the Gargoyle. Because she had Deadeye, Snipe just one-shots. There. Next is Ledin. And I think I'm going to have Ledin Divine Guard up right here, perhaps. 
をつける時が来たらご命令を And Yulia should pray her up. But before I do the prayer, I think I'm going to have Elwyn frontal assault this Miss Dancer. I doubt I'll kill it. Oh, I did kill it. What do you know? So then I can just pray her up here. Left to the end. Owen tanked the hits from the Minotaur and lived. But Liana dies. Because of the ignore guard effect. I hate it. So I misplaced my Liana. I should. That was my mistake. Whatever. Battle's nearly over. Yulia will use Holy Justice now. To attack the Lancer General, crushing that. I'll have Narm shoot down the Minotaur. And then Ledin can just get ready to fight against the Lancer General. There we go. So that turn one positioning really worked out. Okay. In terms of forcing the enemies to attack specific targets and so on. So now, let's jump back into the level 60 version, and this time do it, do it for the second feat, which is to beat it with the Empire team. Alright, so for my party in this battle, these four are pretty much must brings. It's the last character that I can play around with. I tried Sonya, but she didn't work out very well. Um, so I'm going to change the plan and use someone else. Maybe Hein would be a good idea. He can teleport, he can do damage. Hein might be a good choice. Leonhard is another great choice though because he can really rip into the Lancers. Unfortunately my Leonhard's dark guards are garbage. So looking at this, I'm pretty stuck in terms of Empire soul like heroes. So you know what? I am going to have to try hide. Let's just do this and begin. So let's start with Iris launching a range attack to basically disable the guard skill. That's all she. Uh, her goal was. So then I am going to have Bernhard oh, Imperial power up. Fashion buffing. And then Leon can assault the succubus to one shot it. It's not in danger zone. I'm going to retreat back. Need to make sure I'm outside of the range of this catapult, right? It can move one, two, three, then one, two, three, so I am outside of the range. Hi. Hi -yo. Elwyn is going to smash the Shika Mage. There we go. Hi. And Hein. It's just going to stay here for now. So Bernhard guarded against that attack, which meant they didn't get to maneuver away my characters. Bonus! So now, Ooh. what should I do? 
I need to heal up Bernhard for sure. But before I heal him, I think my best option is to shield bash and stun the Lancer General. And I barely, barely survived that. Wow. But survive I did. So why don't I frontal assault with Elwin here? That crushed that one. Hein will fireball the Minotaur. Iris is going to heal up. Bernhard. And then Leon is going to chivalry up and hit the catapult. Hello. This way, I'm forcing the attack onto Hein. Or not. I thought I was forcing the attack on Hein. Instead, he wrapped around and killed off my Elwin. Ooh. That's fine though. Hi. At the very least, I should be able to finish off the Minotaur with Hein. Oh. I am going to have Iris range attack with the guard's left hand to disable his guard. Oh. Strong arm up Bernhard now and have Leon assault the Mist Dancer. Interesting. Oh yeah, guard is disabled. Nice. That's fine. But everyone survives because of the way they were built. So Leon easily crushes that guy. And now this is where I start teleporting away. <laughs> Bernhard against two Lancers, and I should be able to win. Hi. Hi. Oh. So let's start with Bernhard. Oh, no. Action And then I'm going to have Leon attack and run away. So teleport him completely out of the way, which is worth it. Hi. And I'm just gonna end Hein's turn for now. go. Battle successfully completed at the level 60 version. The level 70 though is going to be a nightmare. The strategies I used here for the level 60 absolutely will not work for level 70. I can already tell because I won't have any- I won't be able to kill off the enemies the way I did at 
The level 70 version, the enemies are just have too many hit points. So while I was able to one-shot quite a few enemies at level 60, it won't happen for level 70. So I'm going to have to very much think about how to beat the level 70 version. Right. But for now, level 60 is done. So there we have it. Thanks for watching, everyone. Nitro out.